So thank you everyone for taking the time to join us this evening. We have Met and Eula online. They are from one of our newer developers that we are working with. It's a developer company called uh, Uzurai. And um, I'm going to hand over to Met because he's going to give us a little bit of an introduction about Uzurai the company and what they've been doing and what they're planning to do a little bit. And then they're going to take us through this fantastic uh, new project of theirs called Aurora Bay, which does have amazing sea views and is in a fantastic location. So I won't say any more, Met, but I will hand over to you. Thank you so much. And thank you for everyone for joining us today, tonight. And um, I will start with uh, uh, our company. Um, maybe you heard before, I don't know, um, in northern part of Cyprus, there was, a, there's still also uh, a real estate company named Borai uh, Real Estate. And our founder, I could be found that, um, company and then they decided to uh, become a developer and so here we are so basically we are uh, apart from uh, Borai MLAC and Borai Developments we are uh, building our project as Ozerai with uh, I could base over 30 years of experience and we have um, three different projects right now, two of them in Tatusu and one of them in uh, Lapta in the northern uh, sea short of the island. And I will go with the Aurora Bay. Yes, they have uh, their new project, Exquisite, which is in Lapta, um, is yep. very exquisite. And we will have a separate Zoom call um, for that project because it's in a very different location, a very different style of project. So um, we thought it would be easier to have a separate Zoom call on that on that particular project. So thank you so much, Met, for showing us Aurora Bay. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Paula. And... Today also, I'm going to mention uh, at the end of Aurora Bay presentation, we have first, our first project, Carapil, um, is located here. And our new project, Aurora Bay, will be located here, as you can see. It's really uh, close to the seaside, like three minutes uh, walking distance. And let me show you from the Google maps google earth so that it can be easier um it's the um east part of the islands it's north this is Karapil, and this is the aurora bay project um, Mayor, sorry to interrupt, just, just to give everybody um, a little bit more of a, a, a pin location of where Island. it is. Um, how far is it from the um, junction? Because you've got the um, the junction that you can turn right to go across to Famagusta or you can turn left to go to sort of uh -huh. in that area. How, how far is it approximately from that junction? Um, it's like seven by driving yes. uh, for yeah. the junctions here like it's really close yes and it takes uh half an hour to go to Kyrenia and it's approximately like 30 minutes to the Famagusta so like it's between uh Kyrenia and Famagusta basically perfect thank you and it's like uh one hour to the airport not one hour it's like um let me check on the presentation and yep just a view. Project will here. Kyrenia is here and Pamagusta is here. And the airport is here. Yeah. <laughs> perfect. That just gives everyone a little bit more of a an idea exactly where it's located. So that's perfect. Thank you. And let's go to the we have a um, short video presentation and it shows the, um, the renders 
like the how the layout is located and where is the facilities and the um, opportunities where we have. Let me share it. Perfect. We have a security gate in the entrance. And um, we have uh, one plus one lofts, one plus one apartments, and the, the facility, the building of the uh, one plus ones and the one plus one apartments uh, is just right on left on the screen, as you can see. We have a communal swimming pool here. On the downstairs, we have a game room, a sauna, a gym. A human sized chest. Uh, golf. These are the uh, one plus one lofts. The upstairs, uh, basically the lofts, and the down, uh, the ground floor is uh, the one plus one apartments. And we have um, six garden semi detached villas. These are two plus one, and they have a huge gardens, huge terraces. Like uh, on the wood terrace, we have a barbecue uh, included. And we have um, infinity pool villas also. They are coming. <laughs> and a four plus one uh, private infinity villa. This is the uh, four plus one infinity villa. And the rest of it is the two plus one infinite pool, uh, semi detached villas. The also the project uh, named after the Roman goddess uh, Aurora, which is the light bringer, and you will have a um, seamless um, sunset view here. You will see. It. Like basically all the units sharing the one infinity pool. And yes. With that beautiful sea view. <laughs> and the <laughs> land is elevated so that if someone, um, you know, going to build something, they're not going to um, cut your view. Yes, that's important that the 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 land itself is, it has got yeah. a elevation as well to it. Yeah, that's good to know. Also, um, this area has uh, two floors uh, regulations. That's also a plus for the for your view. Yes, of course. And let's share the presentation. Perfect. We can get some more details then with the presentation as we go through as yeah. well. Super. I'm trying to find the presentation. <laughs> it's never easy when you're sharing the screen and trying to find these things. <laughs> the huge advantage of this area, some people um, looking for sea view, somebody's looking for mountains view, but in this area you can see and mountains, wonderful view and sea view. Exactly. This yes. is something that's incredible. Definitely, yeah. definitely, I agree. Today I'm going to uh, explain, explain you why North Cyprus, why Tatlusu, and why Ozerai, and why uh, Aurora Bay, and how um, Ozerai works. Um, I think there's no need to mention the strategic location, like it's really close to the Europe and Asia and uh, Middle East and Africa, like it's really basically the center of these continents. And uh, approximately it takes only two hours flights to the everywhere. It's always sunny. It's really safe country. Like even you don't need to lock your car. Like if you forget to lock your car, you don't need to be afraid because no one does nothing. And the population is increasing. There, are, there is um, 27 registered universities in the northern part of the island. We have a huge, uh, rich cultural heritage. And Varosha and the Gaz Reserve um, is also really 
um, important for the strategic location. And the most important thing is we have almost no tax laws. Like there is no capital gain and you don't need to afraid like, uh, oh, the government tried to steal my money. That's going, you don't need to be afraid like in this <laughs> island. Yes, we have, island. we have some great bonuses on this island. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and also if you come here, like you will see with your eyes, the island has so many natural beauties among the uh, besides the historical heritage like it's really incredible like blue sea and the um, green mountains like it's really incredible i already mentioned all i guess <laughs> <laughs> this is the um the map of the northern part of the island Girne is here iskele is here and famagusta and we are, uh, Taptusu is a part of the Famagusta region, as I mentioned. So these are the some unique places. Um, this is a Bela, Bela Pais, yes. Uh, yes. It's a Bela Pais monastery. It's really amazing. Like um, you feel like you are in a, a dream and also Lola Mustafa Pasha Jami, um, San Nicolas Cathedral. Uh, it's located in Famagusta, and it's the ba it's basically the rep uh, replica of the um, Notre Dame Church Cathedral, and also the Salamis ancient ruins, and some we have um, castles, also uh, inspired inspired um, Walt Disney to have the castle. Thing. Yes, Sleeping Beauty's castle. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and um, Golden Beach, the incredible place you will see. And this is from um, Nicosia, Bukhan, and this is the Kyrenia. And as, as I mentioned, we have many uh, different universities. And also, as I mentioned, there is two flow regulation in Tatlusu. And it's really unique because in Tatlusu, there's many um, carob tree, trees, like they were uh, planted eight, like, I don't know, decades ago, and they were exporting uh, carobs uh, from Tatlusu. That's why it's always green and beautiful. And it's also, developing um, zone so uh, everything will be uh, everything's price will be increased uh, in years you will see and we also have a go golf course by architect David Hamstrock it's a really um, now it's a landmark uh, of the northern part like it's really beautiful green courses you you need to see it <laughs> definitely <laughs> Yes. Could you, could you just um, you seen it. <laughs> in the in the area of Tatlasu where Aurora Bay is going to be? Could you just give people a little bit of an idea of the type of um, uh, infrastructure that's already there? We know it, we know that it's developing very much in that area, so more and more things are going to come. But what's already available in that area? I mean, is there a a small supermarket nearby? Except those types of things. Yes, uh, in five minute walk, uh, walking distance, there's a, a little market. And also if you drive, uh, we have, uh, also it's our meeting point, uh, mm -hmm. Davlos market also. You can find your, uh, almost everything they have. Mm -hmm. And yeah. And there's, and a few, in Tatlasu itself, there's a few sort of smaller shops and, and things like that. Yeah. Yeah, okay. uh, there are not much uh, shops and not uh, big um, city in infrastructure. It's just developing, and yeah. possibly it's going to be like five, ten years later. This is a place who is tired from crowded cities. Yeah. Yes. Who want to, uh, <laughs> breathe fresh air. Yes, enjoy mm -hmm. calm life. Um, also, there are going to be shuttles or bus. Like if people need to go big supermarket sometimes they want to go cinema or some things i believe uh, the company gonna give uh, this kind of service 
Perfect. Okay, that's Thank really you. interesting. Great. Thank like you. Also, um, Tabdusu village uh, and also the the other vi villages uh, close to the uh, our project has many festivals. Like you can buy from the uh, villagers like their own produce, uh, like I don't know many stuff, and yeah. also they produce halloumi. Yes, uh, <laughs> they do. <laughs> you <were> like <laughs> organic <bit> food. <laughs> yeah there's always something to explore there but exactly. uh yeah it's still developing yes definitely um as i mentioned uh with i could pay we have uh, over 30 years of experience and we have many projects uh on the island like in different zones of the islands and these are the some projects that I could be did with Borai developments and Borai Emlak. And this is the Kareta Kareta um, villas in Esantepe and I guess um, in 20 years ago they start to sell it. Yes. Sell them. And yeah. At first, they, they were not that cheap, um, but I guess last resale was 1.5 billion. Yes. Million, sorry. Million. <laughs> yeah. It was uh, 700, 750 first price. First, sold. Yeah. So, yeah. But yeah. it's double. Yeah. And I know that they still, these those villas yeah. still are very good because yeah. I know that because yeah. I like to use good quality materials as well. So that's important too. And we are working with uh, some really important uh, banks to finance our project, not to finance. We have already uh, finance to um, manage, to build, build costs. But um, we are working with the banks so that no matter what, uh, you can be sure that the, if the company, uh, you know, bankrupt or something, these banks are going to finish the product and uh, give, give the, uh, this is the guarantee that you are going to um, have your products, yeah. have your units. But again, because the company has been running for so many years. And I trust from bank. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yes. And we are pro um, providing maintenance and renting services also. So, oh, Raffles, join us. <laughs> <laughs> your dog or your cat? <laughs> show him, show him. Everybody has to see him. <laughs> He's incredible. <laughs> <laughs> the dog. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> And yes, we are providing maintenance and renting services so that you can be sure that the uh, unit that you buy uh, will stay as it is. And yeah, we are uh, providing uh, rental services so that your investment also um, provide you uh, income. Yes. Um, and yes, Aurora Bay. I mentioned, I guess, all of them, surprises. <laughs> <laughs> um, it takes 14 minutes to Asantepe Beach. Tatlusu is uh, three minutes. Zamba Holiday Village, nine minutes. Erjan Airport, uh, 40 minutes. And Kyrenia, uh, 45 minutes. Famagusta, 40 minutes. Uh, Larnaca Airport, one hour and five minutes. Um, you can have access to this, there are um, two beaches. By walking, it's just three minutes. The, also, the uh, market is five minutes by walking. Perfect. And the facilities in the project. Uh, we have 12 uh, two plus one semi-detached villa, six um, two plus one semi-detached garden villa, one four plus one private villa, um, 17 apartments, 19 uh, one plus one lofts. And there will be a snack bar in the middle. Uh, as I mentioned, there will be sauna, a boutique gym, um, communal pool, game room, car park, and other office for the maintenance and renting services. And 
you can be sure that uh, we are providing that um, things to you because um, we are office will be there also and we have security. In our every project, we are using local and modern architecture, like uh, unique Yellowstone uh, Cypriot stones will be there. And we are using um, um, concrete materials. So it's uh, just mix the local and the modern architecture. And we are using quality materials. And these are the uh, wood looking um, ceramic tiles. And it's like, uh, every floor that we are using so that seem will be seem uh, will seem seamless and we are providing as i mentioned uh, maintenance service this is the layout and um, one plus one apartments and the loft will be here these two uh, blocks these are the um, garden villas and these are the infinity ones the communal Pool, the snack bar. Perfect. A really nice boutique little project, actually. Yeah. Like we also work with um, landscape architectures so that you can be sure that um, all these green trees, plants, flowers will be there. And I guess this is the um, the most important part because our uh, competitors are just building the concrete and you know other stuff but the uh, green touch i think is change everything yes yeah this is the one plus one apartments um fifth gone sorry <laughs> 59 uh, meter square meters indoor area we have 24 meter square outdoor area we have um, two um, terraces here one here I think it's cut I will change it and this is the one that face to the um, communal pool we have AC infrastructure and open plan kitchen and sliding door wardrobes in the bedroom what this what, is a bed what are the starting prices of these particular units 138 hundred. Yeah, and um so from this um air conditioning units white goods they are all extra extra yeah yes yes okay perfect Okay. We and only have the infrastructure. These are garden for... apartments, aren't they? These ones. Sorry. These are garden apartments, aren't they? These one. Yeah. Yes. Garden ones. Yep. Okay. Lovely. And these are some images from inside. Really, very nice and modern. Just clean lines. Very bright. <laughs> uh, yeah. And also there's so much space that even it's a uh, one plus one, there, there's so much, so much storage. Yes. Yeah. And this is the bedroom. Bathroom. Yes. And this is the lofts. Um, 67 uh, square meter indoor area, 20 square, uh, square meter outdoor area we have. We have um, a huge um balcony here in the lofts and we besides the balcony we have a, a open terrace but uh external uh access mm -hmm. and this is the entrance bathroom again open plan kitchen the living room stairs and upstairs we have a bathroom, wardrobe, and um, the bed. Yeah. So these are these are like mezzanine floor. Yeah, the mezzanine floor with the bedroom, uh -huh. and then access. Also, this shower. 
Mm. Yes, with the shower as well. Yeah. Okay. And then roof terrace on the top as well. Yes. Yes. So just without barbecue. Yeah. Yeah. Just without barbecue. But you can <laughs> have those if you wish to. That's something that you can add on. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. And and what price do these? What price do the loft start from? Um, I need to check after the presentation. No problem. Uh, yeah, one hundred sixty-five. But seems like one is left only. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, right. just only, yes. <laughs> we just uh, late. We get the news last price. Ah, okay. late. We get it's why we don't have time to learn yet. <laughs> <laughs> No problem. That's fine. We can we can clarify the prices later on. No problems. But we know that the garden one plus one units they start from one hundred thirty eight thousand. So that's our sort of starting point. Yes. yes. Perfect. Okay. And then again, beautiful insides. Same Scandin Scandinavian um, plain design. Very nice. Minimalistic and elegant. Yes. Together. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> and functional. <laughs> and two plus one semi detached garden villas. 106 square meters indoor area, um, 94 square meters outdoor area. We have five terraces, uh, AC infrastructure. And every bedroom is end suite. Um, they have detached private gardens and they have built in barbecue on their terraces and hot tub infrastructure. Yeah, perfect. One terrace is here, one terrace is here, one here, one here, and one in the roof. Perfect. Beautiful. Really nice. They're These going are to be the amazing. yeah. Going to be absolutely stunning. Yeah. Definitely. Like they have very symmetrical, um, nice design. Yes. Yeah. These are the roof terraces. And you can also have a um sea view from here. Yeah. Really nice. Also, a lot of storage in the kitchen. And when is the project due to be started, Mert? Um, in October, right, Julia? Am, am I right? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I just need to check. <laughs> uh, October 23 this year. Yes. Yeah, okay. this year and um, after Thank two you. years, yeah. uh, October 25. We'll be ready. Yeah. We are waiting for December, but possible October. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. So the end of this year basically is when yes. we yes. start. Yes. Okay. All right. So yes, these are off plan prices. Um yeah. but uh obviously it's it's starting to sell already. It's a popular bit and also because it's boutique, there's not loads and loads of units available for sale. So um definitely. And yeah. almost uh, half of it, I think more than half of it is sold, reserved. So be quick. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the um, Infinity Semi Detached Villas. We, I, it's basically the same design, but little touches. Like we have a um, L shaped window here so that you can have more ac access to this sunset and the uh, infinity pool view and these are 120 square meters indoor area 94 outdoor area uh, square meters outdoor area we have a large kitchen and yes they have the infinity pool i think that's the most important part yeah like um, from this terrace you can have access to the pool directly from your terrace so it's Incredible. Yeah. Yes. So with these ones, you get the infinity pool and you get the barbecue on the roof terrace with the hot tub infrastructure available yeah. if you want wish to have it up on the roof terrace as well. Yeah. Okay, perfect. 
And then I know you, Liz, just answered. There is one four plus one uh, mm -hmm. available on this on this site. Just yeah. One. Um, but yeah. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. And these are the terraces. Like it's stunning. Perfect. And these infinity villas. What are the starting prices of the infinity pool included? What are the starting prices of those? Five hundred thousand. 500,000. Okay. All right. And when, I don't know if you're coming onto this, what, what's the payment plan available on these particular properties? Um, two different statement plan. Uh, I will going to mention at the okay. end. Of the no problem. Uh, no. Um, and if the customer wants to, um, uh, First, we need to down payment, and then um, um, they can pay as equal uh, each month in two years. Also, this is an available option. Okay. Uh, oh. with, uh, um, stage payment plans. Okay. So it's um, 30 or 35% for down 35. payment? <clears throat> okay. 35. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Did I say 30? <laughs> No, no, 35. <laughs> I just asked the question. So 35 <laughs> down payment and then the remaining 65%. Yeah, standard plan with a stage plan. Uh, uh, between stages, it's around three months. Yeah. Little less, little more. And uh, 10, 15, 15% like this until like carcass, windows, everything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If customer would like to get his own monthly payment or something, this is everything possible to discuss. No yeah. problem. Yeah. All right. So the basic the basic plan for this particular project is basically construction period, as you say. So, you know, every yes. three or four months or so as the next stage happens, then a payment would be requested of sort of 10, 15 percent, according to. Um, and again, all of that would be laid exactly. out. Yes, yes. Contract yes. of sale anyway. But this is more of a construction plan, payment plan. But mm -hmm. it can be discussed if someone wants to yeah. do something slightly differently. Um, Definitely, we are open. Yep. Okay, perfect. And if anyone is able to sort of pay more than 35%, are there any incentives from that? You know, if someone was able to pay 50% upfront, is there anything that can be done? Um, of course. <laughs> if they want to um, pay the half of it, uh... As a down payment, we are giving 5%, uh, no, 10%. 5% uh, or furniture pocket. Yes. It's, uh, it's about uh, villas. Yeah. About yep. villas. Only, villas. Only on the villas. villas. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Uh, if it's more than 50%, uh, we are not sure, but it's need to speak, I believe. Yes, yeah. okay. All right. Always going to be some discount, of course. Of course. Yes. Okay. Oh, okay. So, as as always, there are different options that can be available. It's just a matter of talking oh, yeah. and discussing and um and going through the process. Perfect. Okay. And these are some images. They are going to be beautiful villas, definitely. And the four plus one private infinity villa. <laughs> it's basically the <clears throat> double of um, the semi-detached villas. Um, it's 240 square meters indoor area. It has, <clears throat> sorry, 195 outdoor area. And they have a kitchen island, if you, uh, AC infrastructure, sliding door wardrobes, and again, every uh, bedroom um, is en suite. They have a det um, detached private garden and seven terraces, built in barbecue, a fireplace, and a study room they have. But um, I will share lately. Um, the um, indoor uh, photos of these in private infinity villas. The, our technical team is working on 
Yes, I know they're still coming up with all of the details, I know. <laughs> yeah, so this would be the normal construction payment plan, yep. as we were saying. Um, mm -hmm. And um, as you said, these, these different amounts, you'd be looking at around about every three to four months. Yes. Payments um, like, through the typical payment mm -hmm. plan. Yeah. We will inform the client, the buyer, uh, before the payment. Uh, how, how much it's going to um, take and when they need to pay. Yep. Perfect. And I'm assuming, obviously, that um, for customers, you would provide them with updates of what's happening, yes. etc. as yes, they go definitely. on. We are going to put uh, cameras uh, in the field so that they can have access to the directly, uh, directly have That's access okay. to the That's images. Great. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> so they can just see as it's going through what's happening at any yeah. time. That's great. Yeah. That's really good. We are just waiting for the uh, electricity. Mm -hmm. but after it, we are going to put them. Perfect. Okay. All right. As Julia mentioned, um, we are giving uh, furniture 10% discount. Okay. But this is, the, this is only for the villas, yes? This is yeah, not only for the villas. Not for the one plus one units. No, no, no. Yeah. no. And also it's valid for a short time. Yeah. Probably in we have one month or something for okay. this. Yeah. Okay. It's starting October yep. and finishing December. Okay. Perfect. And yes. That's all. Okay, no problem. Thank you for that. Um, there was a question um, in the chat box. Um, someone asked about insurance. Now, oh. um, I know that um, there would be you as the constructor um, developer would offer some sort of insurance uh, for a certain period of time, and that's all included uh, within the contract. I think it's probably uh -huh. five years, isn't it, as a as a general building yes. insurance. But obviously if people want to insure the property as in like their contents uh -huh. and things like that, that's done individually by the owner once they've taken um, yeah. hand over. Um, and there are many different insurance companies here offering those types of services. So uh -huh. from a construction point of view, there is always an insurance offered by the, the constructor, the developer themselves. And that forms part of the contract of sale, but personal insurances for personal goods and things like that, that's always done mm -hmm. separately after handover um, via uh, companies, insurance companies that are, that are here on the island. Okay, yeah. does anyone else have any questions that they'd like to ask? I know that Yulia was answering a couple of the questions as we were. <laughs> yes. Thank you for I'm that. <laughs> Does anyone, would anyone like to unmute themselves and ask a question directly to Mert or Yulia? Oh, everyone's gone quiet. That usually <laughs> means that you've given them too much information <laughs> and they're all trying to take it all in. <laughs> <laughs> but I think I think what's important just to reiterate is that um, as we've got on the screen, uh, it's starting around about October of this year. Uh, intended completion will be by the end of 2025. The one plus one garden units, they are starting from one hundred and thirty eight thousand um, pound. We have the one plus one loft units as well which have the roof terrace too and then we have those beautiful two plus one garden villas we have the two plus one uh with the roof terrace and we have the two plus one villas with the infinity pool so and there is the one four bedroom uh villa on site as well so there's several different options the it is as we've said, it is a boutique project. It's not, you know, it's not a huge, great big project. Um, but as I are looking at those smaller boutique projects, that's what they want. They want more of a family feel to their projects. 
um, where you know everybody gets to know each other, uh, whether you're using your property all the time or whether it's for um, rental opportunities or a mix of both, um, but they really do want that family feel uh, to their projects. Um, so that's why they go for these boutique style uh, properties. But thank you so much, uh, Met and Yulia for taking the time to join us this thank evening. You. I will just ask um, one more time if there's any other questions. By the way, I can um, share the price list. Yeah, okay. I didn't share. Oh, yeah, please do. And yes. We um, only have one lot left. Yes, I know. And <laughs> That's changed <laughs> from the other day. <laughs> Huh. And apartments from 138,000. Huh. Five apartments, yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Thank you for sharing those prices. Obviously, if anyone is interested in finding out more detail, obviously, these calls are just to give people the general information, just share with them what's going on in these projects, the facilities, mm -hmm. things like that. But if anyone on the call is interested in learning more about a specific unit, um, then please feel free to contact the person that invited you this evening or reach out to one of us at Freedom and um, we can arrange to have another Zoom call with Met or Yulia um, to, to go into more detail about anything that you're interested in. But I think I'm just going to offer it one more time to everyone. If anyone has any questions that they'd like to ask directly to Mert and Yulia, please feel free to unmute yourselves now. Uh, it's all kept quiet. <laughs> okay, well, also, thank you. Go on. Sorry, Mert. Um, In Karopil project, I, as I mentioned in the beginning of the presentation, uh, only five units left and yeah. the prices uh are less than um this project okay. um i can you can show very fast very shortly yeah, the address yes only one semi-detached villas two plus one yeah very just... nice price. It's <laughs> plan. Oh, sorry if you've got the price list available on carapel yes. just to quickly show so carapel is up onto the mountain side not far to the mountains. This is uh, seven minutes uh, by car to the beach. Yes. Also, who's living uh, uh, in Karopil, they can use facilities uh, of Aurora. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Yes. We have good. one semi-detached villa here. Start. Uh, it's um, two hundred and sixty-five thousand, and also two lofts and two apartments. <laughs> Uh, it's exactly the same as in Aurora because our project, we have a similar design, similar exterior because it's uh, created by our, I could be our director. And uh, interior, which is also similar. This is, we are always making our same style. Yes. Yeah. 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 Perfect. And facilities wise at Carap Hill, I know there's two communal pools, isn't there? Yeah. One basket court uh one team and yeah two communal Three parking place yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah okay all right so we do have a couple of other units at carap hill as well and carap hill is already under construction that construction has started yes. there when does carap hill when is that due to complete carap hill august uh, september 24 okay so next year next year, one year yeah. later yeah at the moment there are foundation already yeah, yes, I know. Okay. And payment plan wise for Carapilla, obviously it's slightly different. Um it's the same payment oh, okay. plan. Okay. Payment. If you want if you want to know the numbers. <laughs> okay. But would they do they have the year to pay this or is it still two years to be able also, to also yeah. They I guess they can pay. Uh but it's not um uh, two years. It's gonna be like at um, and At the end the of the construction, uh, the, also the payment needs to be pay, um, finished. Okay, so this is a shorter payment plan as well yeah. because it's already under construction. But if, again, if anyone is interested, 
um, if someone's looking for something that's going to be completed a bit faster, um, then this is also available as well. So thank you. Thanks, guys, for sharing this as well. But as I said, if anyone is interested in any of these, then we can have a one-to-one -one Zoom uh, with Yulia or Mert directly to go through the details and to show you in more detail the, the floor plans and things like that. Um, but I think we haven't had any further questions as far as I know. No? Okay, so thank you so much for taking the time to join us this evening and to everyone else online, thank you for joining us. Um, we look forward to seeing you all soon. Hopefully we will get to see some of you in Cyprus very soon and we can show you the land, we can show you these projects in person. Um, but thank you again for joining us and we hope that you all have a fantastic evening and a great rest of the week. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. And Paula. See you soon. Take care. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.